Hey guys, it's Tanika and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, okay, in today's video, I really, really need to clean my makeup room. It is filthy and I also want to give it a little bit of a makeover. So I'm thinking a Kmart trip. Mm -hmm. I'm just getting a bit sick of all the white in here. I feel like I really need to change it up. Everything's so mismatched and... I don't know, it's just making me not want to be in here. So, it's time for a revamp. Let me quickly show you what it looks like. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm not. So let's just bring you around here. This is my desk. Like, what am I doing with my life? I know, hideous. And then again, I've just got crap here, crap here. If you've seen my last clean and organize with me video, you would know this is like a regular thing. <laughs> so yeah, I am going to make myself look a little bit more presentable, not much more, but a little bit more. And then let's go to Kmart. Okay, so I'm in Kmart. This is the shelf I want and I wanted the matching desk, but I cannot see it in the walnut finish so I'll pick this one up anyway found it they keep the desks in a different section for some reason but that's all good now I just need to fit it into this mini trolley so I wanted a new rug I originally wanted this one here but the photo it looks gray and here it looks blue that matches my carpet so I'm not too sure I would love to get one of these like fake cow skin rugs but I don't know <laughs> okay I'm home from Kmart this is my bookshelf and my desk under there I'll show you the other things I got this mirror how cute is that and then I also grabbed this vanity stand so it's got like the mirrored bottom with black border I don't know what to call that but how cute I got this vase got a bit of like a brownie tinge to it and I got these little flower looking things as well as some of the pom pompous pampas grass that's been really popular so I'm gonna put that in there I think those tones will just go really nicely with the wood and then I got a candle to match so I just got this little rug it's like a doormat but I just want it to go under my chair because in our rental the carpet's pretty cheap and the carpet gets like dented real easily. So I got that to try and protect it. So all this come to about $135, I think. Now, before I bring all of that in and start redecorating the room, I really need to clean up. So let's put on a little time-lapse and get to it. Okay, so I made some progress, progress, huh? Progress on the desk. This box here, it's just all new makeup probably over the last month or so. And I just haven't put it away yet. So it's in this box. I will go through it and decide what I want to keep and what needs to go. I feel better already though. I don't know why I'm so puffed. Like I was just sitting down. Okay, I'm going to start with the desk. Let's open it up and see what tools I need. Hopefully it comes with them. So I know first things first when it comes to flat packs is checking that you've got everything. Oh yes, it comes with the Allen keys and one end has a little screwdriver on it. So I don't have to go through Clinton's tools and try and find things. Four of those, four nuts and two Allen keys. All right, I've got all the tools. So let's, um, let's try and put this together. I'll time myself, see how long it takes. I'm 
kill him this. Just call me Bob the Builder, seriously. I spoke too soon, guys. I've made a mistake. <laughs> okay, so the next step is to put these like support bars on like one side of the desk. So as you can see, I've got holes. Can you see that? There's a hole there on the outside and holes on the inside on this one. This one has no holes. And then I've got the holes on the opposite side. So they need to be like here and here, but instead I've got it here and here. Damn it. <laughs> so I think that means I need to take them off and put them, or maybe I just take one off and flip it around. Oh man, I thought I was doing so well. I did it, I built my desk. Oh my God, this stupid thing here oh, was so hard to put on. Like, oh, oh, what the hell? All right, one down. I love the color of it, isn't it nice? Ew, dirty. All right, on to the next one, the shelves. I think they're gonna be a bit more difficult. How long did this take me? Where's my timer? I did have to take off one of the legs and put it on again, so that was silly. Wow, it took me 28 minutes. Don't call me Bob the Builder. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, these instructions look a lot more detailed. All right, it's been 30 minutes and I'm slowly making moves. I'm about to put all the shelves like onto the bracket. So, <sighs> all good. I did try and get Clinton's drill cause I thought that would be easier, but I don't know how to put the actual like this bit like the screw bit from the drill into the end of the drill. So that's a bummer because that would like uh, that would make life a lot easier. So instead I've got this little screwdriver and uh, I'll just be here screwing away. <laughs> So I got my shelf built, there it is, looking good. It took about 45 minutes. That one was a bit hard, but I did it, ah, yay. Wow, I thought I was filming that whole time. I wasn't. So as you can see, I brought the shelf in and I've just moved everything off of my desk onto the shelf so that I can get the desk out of here. I'm also getting rid of this fluffy mat and this cushion. I will do a Marie Kondo and say thank you for your time. Thank you, Pillow, for treating me well, but it's time to go. See, this is what I was talking about, how things leave dents in the carpet. Like, it is just a rental, so I think they just put like the cheapest carpet in, but I will take note for when I build a house, not to use shit carpet, because that is so annoying. I think that looks so much better already. Oh my God. Now I know the white drawers look out of place, but I need them for all my makeup. And I like to have it on a bit of an angle because it's easier to get to when I'm sitting down doing my makeup. Okay, well now I just need to reorganize my desk and then I can start decorating my shelves. I think I will keep a little bit of makeup on there. Mm. So these were my other old mirrors. This one's like on a stand with a rose gold base. And this was just a smaller one with a marble you know, whatever. So I love that this has the black outline. I would prefer it if it was on a stand, but look, this will do. It's so cute. All right, you can't really see my face, but here is the box of new makeup that I'm going to go through. Things that I still wanna test and play with, I'm going to put in this, and then things that I already know how they perform, I'll pop them in my drawers. And there might be some things in here that I don't know, I don't want. I'll get rid of, I'll pass them on to friends or family.
All right, this is my foundation, concealer, and primer drawer, and I feel like I'm running out of room. Where am I gonna put all these? Let's do a little bit of rearranging. That's contouring products. Okay, so this is what the desk is looking like. In here, I've got products that I want to continue to try and ones that I use regularly. I've got a few samples there. This is also from Kmart, it's from the kitchen section. My sunscreen and my cellar water and then way too many brushes. That looks so much nicer, I love it. So here it is guys, all complete. I am loving these shelves. I've just decided to keep this here for now. I think I might get some greenery because I think that is what this is missing. So my top shelf, I've just got my lipsticks, my new candle and my plants. <laughs> the second shelf I've got, this is like a letter holder from Kmart with some Morphe palettes and my big Too Faced palette and then just a few little decorative pieces. And down in here, I've got like spare batteries, my hard drive, all that crap, and then some hair stuff. And I know that little rug looks stupid, but I need it there. And then over in this corner, I've got my desk of bits and bobs. So yeah, here is the overview. All right, well leave me a comment down below letting me know what you think of my new beauty space. If you enjoyed watching, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new here, I would love it if you would subscribe. I have a whole playlist dedicated to makeup organization. So I will link that down below. I hope you're all having a great day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.